We learned three algorithms today. We'll use all three in this week's homework when we implement a procedure called tone mapping on an image. Generally, tone mapping is the process of converting one set of colors into another set of colors. The reason we want to do this is typically to take a raw image that accurately measures light intensity and map it onto some physical medium, which might be a piece of paper, or a television, or your computer monitor. The problem is that a real-world scene can have brightnesses that span many orders of magnitude and intensity. A piece of white paper in bright sunlight is literally a billion times brighter than on a dark night. And an output device like a CRT can only represent about two orders of magnitude between its brightest and least bright pixel. So how do we do this mapping here? If we do a bad job, then we'll have images that are either too washed out, overly bright, or instead, overly dark. Let's take a quick look at some pictures to see why this is important. Here's a couple lovely images of Old St. Paul's in Wellington, New Zealand, licensed by the photographer Dean Pemberton under the Creative Commons license. Thanks, Dean. What we see here is two different exposures of the interior of this building. If you look at the darker image here, you'll see most of it is quite dark, and so it shows little detail. If we look at the brighter image, we see a lot more detail in some areas, but bright parts of the image, like the stained glass window, are completely washed out. We can classify this in terms of histograms. In the dark image, most of the pixels are at the low end of an intensity histogram, and in the light image, they're at the high end. What tone mapping does is remaps those colors so they do a better job spanning the entire color range. The intensity spectrum, thus, will look closer to this. In the homework, you'll implement a classic and excellent tone mapping algorithm developed by Greg Ward. This algorithm uses all three of the algorithms you learned today, reduce, scan, and histogram, to implement such a tone mapping. Good luck, and we'll see you in the next unit.